All right, so I suspect that took way too long to do this. So a normal person probably could do this in a lot less time. That's probably a solid half an hour, but 35 bucks for two LED bulbs. We'll see how they work. <clears throat> we'll take it out tonight and give it a roll. I only broke two pieces of plastic, so that's not bad. Maybe having a garage would be nice. Yeah, I guess, someday. All right, later. Thanks for watching. All right, today we're gonna change these headlights, not by choice, in this 2015 Jeep Cherokee because the uh, driver's side burned out again. It's only been four years, so I'm gonna try these LEDs and see what happens. This time, not the most fun you can have in a day, but uh, let's see what happens here. You need an eight millimeter socket, which I have my little tiny one. So um, let's get started. First thing you wanna do is turn your wheel all the way to the right. So you can get in there and work. Let's see how that did. Yep, no, no. Not a ton of room, but it's gonna have to do. Alright, hold on. Yeah, sorry about this lighting. It's nasty, but it's nasty for me too. I can't see what I'm doing here. So I think there's three bolts. I guess you can call these things bolts. I'm not really sure. Oops. So take these off for starters. I'm gonna peel this. Peel this molding back. This thing is covered in mud because I uh, was on some dirt roads a week ago. And uh, weird thing is, I did not know that this thing had a burnout headlight because usually. There's an idiot light that shows up in the display, but that didn't happen this time. So I don't know what's up with that. I'm gonna have to take off these gloves. I'm trying to keep the bulbs, new bulbs, clean. Um, so it's been still pretty tight. I think the last time I did this, I used the bungee to hold this flat back. So we might go get a bungee cord here. Put it around that strut. All right, let's get these out of here. This lighting's terrible. Sorry, I can't see either. It's uh, finally a sunny day here we've had. Not sure that one was doing anything. So, let's see. Once you do that, then somehow you have to get your big fat fingers in here and pry this out. Yeah, so way in there. Well, it's way up top here. Can you see that? It's way up there. It's the one with that little orange thing on it. So somehow you have to get your hand in there and take that out. Plastic tabs on it, but they don't seem to be moving very well. I don't understand this. How do you think I did that last time? I have an idea. I don't know if you're going to like it. Stay here. Oh, we got it, finally. I think. It finally moved. But I don't see how you're supposed to... You turned. Now you got to pull this out somehow. I don't get how you're supposed to do that either. You'd never know I did this before, would you? All right, there we go. I think we finally got it. Jeez. That was no fun. All right, so here we go. That's your little cap. Plastic tab. You have to pry back. If you like skin on your fingers, this isn't a job for you. So, I don't think I'm able to do it with these gloves on, but I'm also losing all the flesh on my fingers. Well, all right, so there you go. Gee, that was no fun at all. And this one doesn't even look like it's burned out. Which is weird. Here's the bulbs we're going to use. 
Yeah, they give you little gloves. Oh, look at that. I'll use their little gloves then, I guess. I don't know if this is a good idea or not, but we'll find out in a minute. So let's use their little gloves. Once again, I don't know if this matters. Which way it goes on there, does it? There's a groove. It's gonna go this, I think. That's that. So now I'm gonna pop this up here. Okay. Right. Guess that's that. I don't know if this works without this cover. I guess we'll find out, right? I guess it works. So we have light. So let's put this back together. So hold on a second here. Like I said, I'm only doing this side because I did the other one as an LED. I don't think I want to have one LED and one not LED. Sounds like a good way to get pulled over, right? Out of here. Seems like it's... Oh, look at this. This one's totally different. Some big... Oh, what is that? There's something in the way here. It's going to make this even less fun than the other side. What do you know about that? This might be a bad idea right here. Put this through the wheel this time because I don't know what's going on here. What in the heck is that thing? Wow. That's going to be at zero on the fun meter right there. We have to get up to here. So what is this thing? Yeah. This one's all going to be done by fuel, fuel apparently. Well, I got the little thing turned. Wow, well, that came out easier, but you can't see what you're doing here at all. Good luck getting two hands in there for the clip. Wow, that's a zero on the fun meter there, folks. Let me tell you that. This side is no fun at all. This one's hot. And that's got two clips holding it on. My little tender skin can't do it. Big uh, thing in the way here. Wow, that's no fun at all. All right, stay tuned here. I'm gonna try and get in there. Oh, good. I broke one of the tabs off. Nice. Oh my gosh. Again, zero on the fun meter. All right, let me get the other gloves. super happy but I don't think it's gonna come out so all right let's disconnect the bungee cord 
which I don't know if you need to do that or not, but I did. I'll wait for those fog lights to burn out some other time before we do those. three screws back in and you start your Jeep up and see what happens. I don't know how long that took, probably probably longer than it should. But it was only 35 bucks for the bulbs. So it's not terrible I guess, right? And this side Seemed a little more daunting, but I think it actually was easier in the end. Hopefully these things last a while. Alright, so we got an LED on this side. LED on this side. Look at those super yellow fog lights now, but oh well, we're gonna have to stay. Alright, thanks for watching.